What is going on, everybody? Welcome back to the mask, and we are here yet again. House of the Dragon. This is not a episode review because, as you know, the season is over. But we decided to grace you guys one last time with some House of Dragon content. But before we get into that, you know the vibe. The crew with me, and I will not break tradition. They must get these intros. So first up, we have the man, the myth, the legend. I'm calling him the Mad King. I've always called him the prophesied one. I called him Mad King Targaryen. I put full respect on the madness. Some say that he was born a black, but then he pledged the green. Others say that he rides two dragons. It's never been confirmed. <laughs> but we have none other than Nano Wagwa Mabro. Wagwa Han, thank you very much, man. Like the intro again. I think we got to put in something about Damon's a bitch in there or something like that, just to really round it off. <laughs> <laughs> We're going to put those captions. That's how you all end. <laughs> okay. Put that on his um, on the first parchment he signed when he became king. <laughs> <laughs> king of Shots, man. You know? Damon's a bitch. Uh, oh, Lord. And the men. Andals. Damon's a bitch. <laughs> yeah, right. Let's just put it up. <laughs> okay. And now, I do the second. The lady of the court. Myth has it. She was born holding a blacklist of power. Another myth claims that was a full eclipse. Some even say that she may have been friends with Valerio and the Black Dread. That's just how you tune with the darkness she is. <laughs> Queen the first men and the Andals, first of her name, Els Targaryen. <laughs> Hello. How are you doing? I'm all right, thank you. How are you? I'm okay. I'm okay. You know, I've just realised now that we're doing like this episode, I still didn't got no damn ninja for my damn self. <laughs> <laughs> nah, as I give you guys these intros, I'm thinking to myself, no, I should have one. I should have one, but I don't know um, what I would do for myself though. Maybe, maybe for season, maybe for season three. Yeah, season three, one of us will intro you. Mm, come through, come through. I like that. I like that, guys. We are here to talk about House of the Dragon, our uh, love and hate for the show. This time, I thought we're going to do something a little bit different. Instead of talking about our general thoughts, which we already did for um, the season final, what I wanted to do, now that the season is finished and we have to wait a whopping two years, my lord, okay. I want to do a top five character episode. Now, the rules are simple. Your top five would be your absolute favorite. They can be from season one or two. And with the characters that you choose, be ready to defend them once they've been given. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Once these characters have been given, and if they all line up, we will then, as a collective, decide the definitive top five. <laughs> all right. So now that that has been laid out, just to make it easy on you guys, I will go first. I will give you my top five characters. So you're going to give say, all top five, all five, five. I'm going to give all five. And then whoever wants to go next will give their five. And after all five have been given, then we can basically start to eliminate characters that we feel collectively now. Nah, they don't really cut it. And do we arrive at our mm, definitive? Okay. I, know, I already know one that's going to be on your list that needs to get cut. <laughs> of the you know, that's the thing. You think you know, but I can't lie to you. My list is a little bit. Mm. That's, that's the only word I can think of. It's just, mm. okay. With that being said, I'll go and I'll give you my top five in no particular order. Oh, no order. Oh, no order. Okay. We've all given our five characters. Then we can basically place an order to say, all right, cool. Okay. These are the definitives. My five consists of Lara Strong, a.k.a. Club for McGee. <laughs> Wait, oh, okay. Okay. Mm-hmm. Because I don't be lie. You know what? I'm, I'm, I'm not going to come in. I'll come in after. Okay. You know, exactly. Let me, let me get these off. Let me get No, but I was mistaken there. I thought it was uh, <laughs> Rhaenyra's first. Oh. What? <laughs> <laughs> well, <laughs> Okay. Yeah, no, 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 no. Because you were talking about the brother, in it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, when I got played that. When I got in that, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, That's boy. Right. He got, what? Five? What? That's he, me. Yeah, he, he didn't have enough screen time, boy. But, you know, he, he was definitely a strong character, though. Mm. Let me not lie. He was definitely a... <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you know I mean? He was definitely a strong character. He was really out here in the fields, man. But anyway, is Lara Strong, a.k.a. Clubfoot. Second, it's no surprise, my girl Baylor out here. Oh, oh, high tower. <laughs> Otto high tower. <laughs> ah, queen that never was. Rhaenyra. Oh, sorry, Rhaenys. My girl, Maze. Maze the dragon? <laughs> Damn right. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Yo, so okay. Yeah, you then. Bro. 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 Listen, oh, wow. Maze. <laughs> Remember my top five. Okay. All right. Now I'll let you go next. You sure? Uh, okay. Do you know what? I did put mine in order, and I'm going to give it in order. Okay. So at number five is Otto high tower. At number four is Rainice. My list is looking a little green, I'm not gonna lie. Um, at number three 
Christian Cole. Why are you? <laughs> at number... No, 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 no. Well, okay, Cole is there, but he's actually number two. Oh, three. Two. Mm-hmm. At number three is the one and only Eye Patch. And... Oh, God, tomatoes. Tomatoes, tomatoes, tomatoes. Ew. got haters. And at number one is my guy, Clubfoot. Okay. okay. You know what? The crazy thing about that list, we're going to get into it, though, but I'm going to let Els give hers <laughs> before I start. Okay. So, surprisingly, I, I, I've got my own. And surprisingly, my number five is I did my first, but I'll get into that all thing. But I think they're uh, definitely on mention. My number four is the Grand Mason. Mm. Oh, okay. Okay. Well, okay. My number three is Rainies. Mm-hmm. My number two, I've done a curveball and I'm saying young Rainera. If we're if we're if we're doing it across. And my number one is obviously you know, my baby Mabela. Because she's just she's my fave. And that is my list. Okay, okay. Um to be fair, if it's if we were like pulling like on one season, you already know who would have been on my list. But I thought, you know what, after combining both seasons, give a full overview of the character. And so I am surprised that both that is neither of your list and this bit of your guy. So but listen, I already told you yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm done with yeah. you. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? He's gone. He's out. That, exactly. Yeah, you know I mean, because me and Els made it very clear I that we it. that we are people that are not fans. We're fans. Yeah. Unlike someone. Someone <laughs> hey, I've got dick my riding. Reason. I have my reason. Listen, dick riding, bro. Really if it don't right? make sense, you gotta let it go. You know what I mean? If it does not make sense, like you just <laughs> can't <laughs> and hold on to it. Because under under that same kind of logic here, yeah, I could have easily gone to season one and be like, you know what, yeah, Dame is there in it. Like hundred percent. If yeah, I was I- just going in season one, Damon, I'm going to put him back. Like, but I was like, to add them both together. That's what I'm saying. So his fall off was impeccable. That's why he just went off the list. I, I can't even lie about that. That's 100% true. And in the same breath, that's the reason why, without question, Damon is first to go. Damon is first to go. But I can tell you this right now, Damon ain't making that top five neither. <laughs> wait, <laughs> wait, wait. Okay. Yeah, I mean, you're, you're getting, do we have to discuss okay, this one right now? Uh, like, we can I, do it. Abso- absolutely. I would say, right, the reason he is number three on my list, okay? Now, we need to see, like we're saying, the come up, right? He started off with Dubai's, lost one, decided he wanted to be king, got swords and shit, got the biggest dragon, basically the king, but he hasn't got the title. So that's why I even put him at number three, otherwise he would have been a higher list. For his goals, he's accomplished is what I'm going to say. There was, it hasn't really been a fall off, it's just been rising, rising, rising. you got to give wow. him top five status. Just who wow. has done that? He fell the, the, the delusion is so real because you even placed Christian Cole higher than him. That's how I already uh, know him. Christian, Christian Cole. Christian Cole is his comeback has been that's top the, that's the best come up ever listen you have to stop using this road mentality uh, to excuse <laughs> that <board's> behaviour <laughs> like yes these men came off the curb <laughs> and got into the big house but these characters these men are bottom barrel bro but, bottom barrel you can't say he's bottom barrel listen the people at the bottom are a daryl and you should have put you on your list bro uh, uh, you should have put you on your list bro Benicio though know, it's like oh, okay you're saying she's up there but it, and like we say so many times Benicio you either live or you die in this Again, it's a was a sac- she sacrificed herself. Oh, that's yeah. see, that, that's nice, but you still did. <laughs> but you sacrificed herself for the greater good. Dude. What aiming is the self serving? You know, self serving yeah. but alive, achieving oh, my goal. You see what I mean? Like, you know, a broken wooden throne ain't gonna do nothing. For you. you know, because you don't <laughs> like him. I get it, but no, if he, no. Him, if he on his vision board, with the crap, <laughs> <laughs> he's looking at it with his one good eye, and it's like I'm both better. No. You know, I, I can't complain right now. Listen, I'm all for giving credit where credit's due. He just gets one. <laughs> Hundred percent. I mean, because the biggest issue that Eamon has is, like you said, he had his vision board and did the onlooker. You'd be like, oh, raw, you've really achieved. But has he though? Because the simple fact is, he's the very definition of someone who's wanted the job for so long. He's basically Gordon Brown. Man wanted to be prime minister for so long after Tony Blair. The man got the job. What did he do? Crumbled. And that's what Eamon done. Eamon wanted this crown for so long. Talked about how he studied for bare years. Learned the sword, which we've never seen him use, by the way. He bitched me. He finally got it. He finally got what he wanted and what's happened. Man's out here, yeah, trying to force the most peaceful person in the whole house to ride on a dragon. I don't even think she can ride, right? But he's all, yo, they coming for us. Get on Dreamfire. Even Dreamfire was in the cave, like, huh? Uh, <laughs> you, have, you have to play the card to dealt, innit? You know <laughs> I don't even think he was on his vision board either. I just think he thought, yeah, well, one day I'm doing it. No vision, no strategy, no nothing. The man, he says, and when it mattered, and it was really time to ride on, was it Dragon Zone or whatever? He just crumbled. Hey, I'm not saying he would. King, they got good anything. From where it started, they're alive, they're Unlike a couple people on that other. 
he's, he's got he's got lineage on his on his side. If he was not or I think was not part of the Royal Court, controlled by the winner, right? And he's like, right. I'm winning. Yeah, he won <laughs> if he won it, he could start chatting shit about Rainy, saying that she ran away from battle. That's why he fell off a dragon. Right? He ain't here to say nothing else. Nah, that was a scene. <laughs> no, was a scene. He could what? say a dragon was also a piece of shit. Nah, he's not. He's not even done that. <laughs> Maybe he's ain't there to tell the story either. Yes, sir. Oh, I, so, I can't put two dead people high on the top five. In fact, yeah, we got emotion. That's not good. I like the woman, but I can't be top five because you're not inside the club. How are you gonna hate from outside the club? Oh man, because she because she in the club on the wall that like, he's literally been voted there for her portrait right there, saying one of the hardest to ever do it. Yeah, this season, like, to, look, there's two seasons. So we might watch season three and you forget this one's name. Never, <laughs> you never know. You think Corliss is gonna let that happen? No way. Now like, Corliss, you see, I was contemplating putting him in the top five, but then I was like, nah, no like, way. He's, he's even lower than Damon. Be honest, with you. I mean, that's probably do a top 20 and he'll come in at number 20. Like, there's nothing that happened yeah. in there. That's true. Yeah. There, was, there was nothing for him to do. Not even that he was a bad character. He just didn't do anything. Yeah, he just school. hadn't done all stripe. Maybe, maybe, you know, if he jumps on this seat and starts chopping down Viv, like, because now we're going to see, because this is his remit. He's like, I'm a C guy. I'm always been at the ego. You know, he might. I don't have a hope for him out there, do I? I exactly. Just think... I don't have any hope. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, if he goes. He's um, got that job. That's him. Yeah, yeah I, need, cause I need him because I need him to, again, do a bit more when it comes to his um, tactical prowess because he is the bosses of the sea and we ain't seen him on a boat once so yeah. in this season again I don't really expect him to be fighting like that because he's not really like that I mean this is supposed to be your time though we're saying he's not yeah. really like that because yes. we always know him to be on the sea so this is your time now now we're here no this is what I'm saying but we need all hands on deck is war now right so whether, yeah. whether you're like that or not everyone needs to be fighting the less no do I don't it. again no, we ain't got time for me up. I don't see him being a fire I, I kind of see him what I want to did I say is you know when um, Tyrion commanded um, the, the army um, oh yeah yeah, on, yeah. On, on Blackgate strategy. and when he made yeah made the crazy strategy said listen yeah. we're gonna put wildfire raise the chain lock him in and then just blow everybody up yeah. that's what I see Paul yeah. doing Even I want that, to see that's like, like, I, I mean yeah, yeah. yeah. I'm to me that's, yeah and that's still yeah. fighting in my opinion yeah so, oh, okay yeah okay yeah, yeah. okay that's fine with Tyrion it was like okay he faces a grown man uh, it's problems <laughs> but you see Snake you know you've been about the boat I mean, you use the waves the old you know like, <laughs> chopping lake like you know how to do this or something yeah. hard turn to starboard exactly <laughs> like, <laughs> it, like, and then you chop off his head as it goes or chop off the rope the cell come knocks a couple people off like this is your shit do your life but anyway he didn't make the list of people <laughs> that's all okay fair enough so um, based off the fire that we've given um, automatically we can agree that whichever character crosses over they're automatically in the running for top five so I think that was that so we Absolutely. had Bob Four. We had um, Rainice. A hundred. Yep. We Baylor. had Baylor. Oh, I didn't have Baylor on my list. Also. Yeah. Okay. So Baylor is up for contention. So you know what I mean, like, cause me, cause me, and, cause me and Els would defend her. To f- yep. I'm. Um, yeah. Oh wait, did you know? Because I'm, I'm not saying she, she was close, but when I really thought about it, I don't know, I don't know enough about her. You understand? If I'm, I think I like her, but you know, season one, she was a kid. Her mom died. I told it okay, but she didn't really do it. And I think this season, I think she's good, but I think in season. Two, all she done was like calming down Jace. I think Jace is holding her back though, because he is, he is every week like, she was just come on be smart you can see she's got smartness in her but she's not able to act on that because her husband's acting like a little bitch every I mean, week. Well, I mean we saw her right husband now, um, and Christian Cole yeah and but the problem is it's like what Nana said the biggest issue with um, Baylor is that she's underutilized by the team itself because even yeah. um, Rhaenyra is not using her to the best that. of her ability so yeah I think that's a glimpse of it yeah when she chased down Christian Cole she yeah. was ready like, 100% and then I was like oh yeah she's on the track but I think that's more because of her age and because of I think obviously Rainer has got a little soft for her that's a East Coast slash like, step bar slash oh, yeah. everything <laughs> 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 I think she just don't really want to you know like she's a bit yeah. a bit skeptical about letting her go but yeah. I think for the remit that she had she did very well yep because she definitely set herself up to be um, a major force in season 3 though so because of that I liked what I got with her Honestly. and I think this yeah and I think the same can be said for um, Clubfoot in this season he was underutilised but in the small bits that he had you saw him a man of a plan a man that is about acting he assessed the situation very quickly and said listen <laughs> you dead Wait. we need to be out of here yeah you know what yeah. for me and Clubfoot like I wasn't going to put Clubfoot because I really dislike him as a character but yeah. I feel like I couldn't not have put him just because of how he played this you know what I mean yeah yeah. and I think yeah go on sorry uh, yeah no like, like you're saying see for me Clubfoot is uh, he's doing a bit of, what's that what's, I forgot man's name 
name? The one that um, they killed. Uh, what was Which his one? name? In Game of Thrones. Uh, what was his, his equivalent? What was his name? Sugar. Exactly. Oh, what? Um, Peter with Baelish. Baelish. Lord Baelish. He yeah, with Lord Baelish. Yes, yes. Yeah. Like, you see, with, why, why I put him as my number one is because I was like, he's like, in season one, he had a plan. He was like, I'm going to see you. I'm going to show me your feet and then I'm going to tell you the secret. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Whatever it was, that's what he wanted to do, right? Season two, she's kind of lost the power. He's latched onto the king and then he's like, mate, because by all means, that guy should be dead, yeah? If it wasn't for Clubfoot, yeah. that guy would be dead. So he's seen it. Like, he's locking the game. I think he's the only one really one playing chess at the moment. Like, you know what? Draw ourselves out because I ain't even strong here. I ain't even in the position where I have to leave either because he knows that I have patches on him. So there you go. We out. Sometimes, you know, you have to step two step back and take 10 steps forward, innit? And I think he's clocked that. That's why I'm just like, do you know what? Even though it's not going maybe to his plan or what he wants, but he's out here active surviving. No one can't say he's not active and he's there. Just to care about me for a little bit, then I'll be back. Yeah, no, I yeah, I agree. I agree. Yeah. That's why I had to put him as a five because I thought, yeah, yeah, no. You've done your you've done what you you've done what needed to be done. Even though I haven't seen you, I respect it. Oh, yeah. <laughs> he came in, he executed, he dipped, he said, Listen, man, I'm gonna I'm gonna throw you in the cabbage again, but this time you're gonna be conscious for it. It's right out. Don't go bravo, chill, you know, go get some some bravo swine, sweet some women, you know. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> some exactly. Exactly and that. We're gonna chill out, we're gonna chill out at this dance the dragon commences, and we're gonna ride back, we're gonna circle the block. If he out of everyone on our list, I feel like I'm I'm least concerned about him dying. Like, I, like his death, I don't see coming anywhere. It does. I, I don't. Yeah, out of everyone else, I, I could see Cole dying. You get me? Like, like, even Otto dying, Eamon dying. Like, there's that I'm about them where I was like, oh, you know, you be careful, but you ain't going to be living much longer. But with Club, I'm just like, hey, he's not even in a dangerous position. I think he's got things on lock. He has. But then, is that a good thing or a bad thing? Because I quite like element of danger. Like, I like, you know, yeah. like with Littlefinger, there was always an opportunity to die. Like, he was, he lived so close. <laughs> Yeah, mixed up. Yeah, yeah he was in there. Yeah, it's actually that very mixed up. But this, this some thought it's just very much under the under the sheet. Makes his little. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? So I don't know. Like I feel like you need another bit more out there. I know. You, I see what you mean. But for me, I'm just putting it in. I just want to live. Right? So why do I? I don't need to be in everyone's business. Yeah. Just the business that's going to push me forward. Yeah. Yeah. But as well, yeah, you I, are. I like that. That could die, but you got yourself out of it. I love that. Mm, yeah, yeah. No, it's true because I think I think that's one of the things which made Baelish such an incredible thinker. It's how he was able to get himself out of situations that otherwise seemed impossible. Yeah. Especially because you didn't yeah. like him, you didn't want him to get out of it. Yeah. yeah. Go yeah. out. Just, yeah. And you're like, you're like, yeah. you're like, yeah. damn. You're like, just someone kill this guy. Yeah. 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 You're the problem. There's, there's two elements of it. I think they're that polar opposites. You know I'm at the madness, but I'm still here. Or you don't know I'm at madness, or just forget about me. You understand what I mean? Like, there's yeah. two ways to play. Like, you can have a, I'm going to be loud, I'm going to be da 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 da. I'm going to be in everyone's business, but somebody may mm. eventually, or be like, look, or one or two as long as I keep you alive that's just fine obviously what happens yeah no I, I I agree I feel like next season it's either going to be like he's going to have to switch it up completely to just with an element of surprise so we're like oh like it's getting a bit dangerous or I don't how many seasons did they said it would be five innit no four four innit four, four, yeah. four so it will have to be he's so do you know what he that he actually has to be either like Lord Bailey or like you know the, the one in Game of Thrones with Little Birdie oh um, what's it called again because they're on yeah yeah, yeah. Like, like, or like him where it's like he the whole thing he's just completely under yeah I think yeah yeah. And I think that's what he's going to. I think the thing that um Hubford uses to his advantage is because he's tripled. You constantly keep on underestimating him, and you don't yeah. even notice that he's there. And yeah. he uses that to his advantage. He's like he's the person you overlook every single time. So he's gonna stay in the shadows, and he's going to be putting people in the right places to make the moves that he needs them to make in order for him to have his ambition. That's how I feel they're gonna play with his character because Baelish, Baelish, even though he technically didn't have any physical strength, Baelish came from a time when. And Robert usurped the throne so now people thought it was possible to become king yeah. you didn't really have to come from a powerful house like the Targaryens anymore like that was done it's whoever has got enough money influence oh, yeah. they can take it so Baelish's thought process was now nah, if I kill off all the strong contenders then it would just be me <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I'm going I'm to sit on this so that's where the, the difference their characters are whereas yeah, up for even the time where only a Targaryen can be king yeah. so the question is how much influence and control can you have of the king's ear yeah. so he's partnered up with the king he can mold and be like alright cool um, this is my racehorse I'm banking everything on there he ain't got no pee pee and he kind of hobbles but damn it <laughs> we gonna get him over that finish line yeah you can listen to what I say he's molding him and mold is exactly the right word exactly yeah you can't be king but technically if the king listens to everything you say who is really the king mm. Mm. so I feel that's how like they're gonna well that's how they should be his character like in the season 3 and 4 alright so with that being said so we've said Club 4 is definitely in the running we've said that um, Renee's in the running we're saying Baylor is a question mark right now. Um, 
Um, and then we have who do we have with is on all three of our list? I think I think <laughs> technically that's it. Yeah, that's yeah, it. Everyone else is just like yeah, it's literally okay. So realistically now, it's because we've got like the definitive two questionable third being um Baylor. We now have to contend for like the other two spots. So um L's you had the because you had the Grand Maester. I won't even lie to you. That's a <laughs> that's a strong candidate. <laughs> I won't even lie. I might go. I might have to. I might even have to sacrifice my girl um Maylise. I love you. I love you, Dragon. I love you, Dragon. But I'm after. I'm ha- I'm after pick her out and move the Grand Maester in. Bro. Um, yeah. I feel that the Grand Maester should get honorable mention, but mm, he I just the Grand Maester. Yeah, right. yeah. As because I'm, I'm still it. Yeah, he's done a lot. Lie. He has done That's a lot. True. I'm with That's you, true. but you know. Yeah. I hope. I he hasn't really made any kings. Kings. technically. I hope no, like he's several kings. <laughs> so, uh, you need to have made his position. Made mm. his position. That's what I was gonna say. Like now that you've said that, I think you might be right in terms of him getting honorable mention. But in the true game, he ain't done anything. He's done his job quite well. He's gone above and beyond and he's loyal. But he ain't really affected the game like that. So I mean, look, I feel like, look, obviously, we'll get on to honourable mention. But I feel like he's more than an honourable mention, in my opinion. Um, mm. I think that when it comes to the Grand Maester, he's held so many secrets. And he just the way he's played his game means that everyone else can be there. Look how many moon drink he bought, Alison. <laughs> <laughs> oh, the look at the pot, yeah. <laughs> if not for that, there would have been babies all over the place. Do you know what I'm saying? So it's like, I don't know. I just like him. He had the more than after pill. I'm not. I'm telling you. I'm telling you. He was listen, 101. No. Them, they had his dress. Cabbage, cabbage leave. He had them on smash. Come on. Like, I think if there ever there was a Grand Mace, he put it up. And yeah. God, more than an honorable mention. My opinion. I understand where you're coming from because he's, but he's not supposed to be a big player like that because what else can you do? But we don't even know. We could get to the end of this and he'd be like, uh, the over strategy. Just don't know. I, I, I see that because as you mentioned a few times, he's loyal. And I was like, is he though? Because we don't really know that he, who, or who is he? All right, uh, do is he loyal because to He took, yeah, yeah he, I mean, he made Eamon go away, but might have been done pay, doctor patient confidentiality thing, though. He took him out. But then, what I would say then, okay, if we keep in Grand Mace it, it, who would you take out? Melissa. I mean, yeah, Melissa's not in there. That, oh, I thought she was in there. Yeah, Melissa, sorry, sorry, Mark. <laughs> okay, sorry. <laughs> yeah, exactly. I don't know why. I don't, you just wasted a bit there. Yeah. I don't know why. <laughs> that dragon. <laughs> <laughs> and listen, I won't even lie to you. Again, it was a, it was, it was a very, it was a very hard, it was a very, very hard because I, I wanted to pick somebody that I felt confident. If that's the case then and we're doing the dragons story. how can you do Melee's over Vega? Exactly over Vega like, what, no, if, we, if, if we're in the top the... five dragons okay Melee's might Vega. come up in there but, but I mean no. Vega's number one. No the, I... the re- no the reason why I didn't pick Vega is simple as half as Vega is... oh I know why you're a hater. No 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 <laughs> he's right no no no, no. It's, it's, it's not it's, it's not even to do he um... don't even listen to his rider. Yeah you know what I'm trying to say he's like cause, yeah because Vega is Vega just an agent of chaos it's really out here to be out here but the reason why I didn't pick Vega is because I feel with what Vega is Vega should have been doing much more I feel like Vega in season 1 set this whole thing in motion oh little, little baby dragon alright but I just felt that and I guess in a way it is tied to its rider <laughs> Vega, because Vega needs to be Vega needs to be taken off the chain in it like unleash Vega and let Vega do what Vega needs to do that would have been like mm. but every time every time like Vega is really about to start something bitch ass Eamon got a you know what I mean like he, was, he has to come and mash up the whole thing by just being him like, so the reason why I gave it to Melise was it man I just I love the underdog man and Melise got heart well, at least got got heart, heart, she, she had the opportunity to burn up everybody at the key at the what's it at the inauguration or whatever they had and she didn't do it no yeah. but let's just say this as well with it because Maylis and Ren- and, and Rainis have a very deep bond like, yeah. yeah they do that's because that's that's one of the reasons why Maylis only has to give Rainis a look and she understands everything that she wants mm-hmm. it's actually quite similar to how um, Damon and Daraxi is and even Rhaenyra all of them are like that with their dragons though. isn't the whole point of bonding no like everyone's well, well, that is part of it, but even well, when Vagar had um, was what was her name? Was her name Lena? No, Lena's her. What was their mom name? What was the oh, the mother, yeah, yeah, yeah. The married name, no. yeah, the one, yeah, the original wife. Like yeah. it was a similar bond in that. Yeah, no. You saw in the dragon's eyes, the dragon didn't want to do it in it, but yeah, yeah. that she don't want to be here in the Yeah, exactly. <laughs> but 
is good. But if you look at it, Vegas won with her is deeper than Vegas won with Eamon. Yeah. yeah. So, because, so again, you can bond with the dragon, but it's how close a bond is. It's, it varies between rider to dragon, though, because of that. It was Rhaenys and Melisa's bond. It was symbiotic, man. She didn't She didn't even give a command. She literally just like, you know, tapped it once and said, all right, cool, so what we're doing. Was flying back, flying back to Dragonstone. The girl turned her head, man. Look, Rhaenys dead in the eye, man. Rhaenys looked at her back, they like, you know, you know what we have to do with it? God damn it. It circled round. Do you know what? Yeah, man. That's a rider, right? I would argue, like, I think they do have Damon. Bond. I think the problem with Vega and Aemon, Aemon, Aemon is the issue. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Let's be real. He just can't, he's just so arrogant. No one can't even, no one can't tell him nothing. The, the Vega already knows, isn't it? Vega's like, oh, whatever, I don't ever like, I just wanted yeah. That's all it is. <laughs> Nobody likes that. <laughs> because maybe, maybe, but I, but as well, I do, I do feel like, yeah, I think out of all of the dragon riders, Eamon has the weakest one with his dragon because. Oh, damn fool. No, 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 no. No, no, no. Just come. No, no, no. Because again, remember, like, because they've just joined them dragons, yeah, like, I don't, like, the no, dragon no, riders, no, yeah, like, yeah, they haven't had years with their dragon. So I'm not. I can't even put them like in the same category as, as like the full blooded oh, okay. Targaryen. Okay. Whereas if if you even look at every other Targaryen minus um minus the sister, because we haven't seen her with her dragon, right? You see, like every time they like they're about to ride their dragons. Have you not noticed that they always touch forehead to forehead? Yeah, I don't. Like, they're like, like always, but I've seen them touch the not, forehead. Yeah, like majority of the time, like before they before they set off. If because if you see them go to their dragons and then dump on to ride them, every every time they've done that, you always see them do the forehead to forehead. Or like they touch their face, like there's always like that bond there. Yeah. Because literally, Eamon is the only one you've never seen that. Like you have never seen him once go up to Vega's head and touch it, like to where they have a connection. Like we're about to ride out. Are you with me? Never. It's, it's never happened. That's so, why we didn't want to do that. With yeah. Eamon is just. Vega's not bad at life though. No, Eamon is just. Eamon is just. No, because because none of you say that, yeah. But literally, that's what um Vega did with um with Damon's wife. Yeah, he loved. I think he's missing. Her, really, and he just thinks, like, yeah. you know, what? I got a ride, I want to climb this. I'm on the trash, but let's go, <laughs> yeah. You know what I mean? like, like, you're the best I can get, but yeah, but literally, before was before she told her to like to like to car her, she came up to her, goes, grabbed her by the head, did all that good stuff, and then looked at her and said, yeah. Do it. And you're like, what, what are you talking about? Is this like a Jakara? She's like, Nah, man, I ain't doing this. She's the real bond, and Eamon is the bill, and that's yeah. yeah. I mean, I can't, I can't, yeah. I mean, I think so, yeah, yeah, yeah. So, because we've definitely digressed, but okay, fair enough. Is this and we'll knock off my um, we'll knock off my. Um, I'll, I'll take I'll take her off. So back to the main thing. Potentially, we're saying that Grand Mason may is may, may take may take a spot then. It's possible. Yeah. But I understand where you're coming from in terms of Mendo. No, we can put a question right. mark. Okay, so we got two question marks. So Grand Mason and um, Bailey. So then we have um, Christian Cole. Uh, no, that was only your mother. Absolutely yeah. not. Yeah, I wouldn't even lie. Absolutely not. No. Wait, wait. Like, what do you mean? Absolutely, absolutely not. Like, absolutely, man. He's not. He's not on Bailey. Come on, like, yeah, I mean, he's close. He's close. The man is fine. I won't even lie to you. Really bad. He is below Melis. Don't disrespect Melis like that. Like Melis got more heart and more integrity. This, because this whole is the Lord Commander of the King. He tried oh, here. Like he he's 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 bro. Respect under him. Nah, poor man. Tried. the King. Like, right, stop, right, stop, right. Okay, so, it's, all right. Let's this way. If he's a green, right? If you were, if you put your green hat on, who's been more loyal to them than the Crystal? Yeah, that I mean, more loyal was it necessity though? Yeah, different. You've not. You've not. Like, even, could have banked out, if he banked out and joined Renea, right? A dragon, she would take him. Nah, she would oh, not. She would take him. Nah. That ship has been and gone. Who, who, not, not, I'm saying at the time, at the time, if he if he chose her, you will see this guy in a whole different light. He'd be like, you know what? She needs him because he's a rider, he's a fighter. Ah, uh, but he gets too jealous. <laughs> jealous? Look jealous, though. Yeah, let's be real, though. Come on. Oh, like, he, no, I'm saying, his entire issue. He fell off a bit. Like, nah, his entire issue was from the moment, yeah. <laughs> from the moment Renero chose not to go and sell oranges. Man was <laughs> done. <laughs> he was done. <laughs> like, when, when, when he did that proposal on the boat, and he said, let's go away to Bravos. Yeah. We're going to sell oranges. <laughs> And she, and she said, give up these silks. You sell oranges. Wait, wait, wait. Bitch, I'm a queen. What are you talking about? I want that crown and that throne. That, that's beneath. He was done out here. Uh, uh, he was never. Yeah. He was never on her team. Yeah. And don't Everyone forget. has their villain orange oratory, yeah? And that's <laughs> okay. What, 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 what has he done that's good? Like, name me one thing that's done that's on honor. I mean, as a commander. But no, no, that, but wait. That's not, I'm, 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 I'm,
I'm like, well, definitely, you know, we're going to take Melis off of there. And the, the way I did it right now, like, you got to be alive though, the story. And this guy's been in battle. Probably the most battles of anyone on the list. He's there. Active. No dragon. Jeffy Sword. Active. No, active no, in okay. there. But we don't okay. see it. But, you know, technically in the story, he's battling every day along with, um, my, okay, that's in season two. So he's been active. Like, we just don't see it, right? Okay. He seems so, trauma when these people got burned. Like, I'm, I agree with you all. And he's, he's done. still acting like a bitch. Like, yeah. About, no, no, he's got three people getting burned through Chris all of a sudden and crying. He, yeah, and he's oh, finished. He's, he's literally finished. Like, the crazy part is, yeah, did you see the line that I said, the funny part, the line came back to me when you were sitting on the log and he, and he told um, Alice's brother that all of our wants and dreams are nothing but ashes at the feet of drag. I said, bitch, mate, he's done out here. I mean, I'm, he, he finished, bro. He, 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 he finished. I mean, he realises if he comes against a dragon, he will die. Bro, bro that's, that's that's always that's always been a fact, my guy. Like, yeah, if, 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 he's, he's not even... Oh, when you're in the not front line, line, like, like if I tell you I'm going to shoot you, you know you would die. But when you see the gun in your face, I'm on the front line of these trenches every day, like, just waiting for this to happen. It might be a nah, little bit. Here, here's, nah, here's, nah, here's the thing. I can definitely understand that if we're talking Game of Thrones. I can definitely stand for Game of Thrones because if you're telling me here, yeah, dragons have been a myth for 170 years. No one's even seen a dragon. We have never seen nothing. Daenerys rolls up, burns half my army, 100%. Bro, man's broken. I don't know what this is. I'm used to sword. I'm used to bow and arrow. I saw a creature that should not exist like over head, book up my men, and then fly out. I'm definitely done. But this man has been raised around dragons his entire life. He knows no, what they're I mean, capable of doing. They've been even, alive and he's because, because even Because even a man who I hate, yeah, Jamie Lannister, more heart, bro. Man, um, man, hold on. Less of the hate of Jamie. Please. Nah, Thank let's, you. Nah, let's be real. <laughs> but, Thank you. With how Game of Thrones ended, yeah, we can't even defend. You see, everything before season six onward, Jamie was goated. The last season, they regressed him season one counterpart. So I don't hold him no more. I can't be like, oh yeah, Jamie. Oh no, because everything what he accomplished got thrown away in the last season. He literally became season one Jamie, and I hate it, season one Jamie. I don't care. Even Jamie, who's never seen a dragon before in his entire life, he's a dragon. Roll up, yeah. Burn half his men. What does this man do? Jumps on a horse, here, yeah. One hand, by the way, with a sword in his hand, and rides to its mouth. I said, this man, yeah. Regardless, heart. You see, the difference is though. I don't respect. Christian Cole. I don't respect me, man, that. You wouldn't have done I, nothing. You would have turned around. I don't, I don't respect that you just run into your death and hope that man. That, that to me isn't heart. That, no. Oh, about he, he saw Daenerys there open because again she was hella cocky. You didn't really think no one can touch her with a dragon. He saw her there open. Oh, yeah. He was like, he said, nah, you know what? Yeah, this this is definitely a suicide mission. But if I can take out the Queen of Dragons, I'm taking her out. And if I go out with her, I go out with her. The man charged head first. He went for her. Then Dogo turned his head. Dane land. <laughs> what the hell do you think this is? And he's like, oh shit. He's like, yeah, that was a bad plan. But still, he had heart. Man yeah. saw an opportunity. Whereas do you think Mr. Cole, Cole, and so we... he would not bam. After that speech he, he gave the brother, he was done, fam. <laughs> if they got dropped right in front of him, man, and he saw a chance till uh, what's it called again iPad and Vega is there he ain't doing shit he would have literally stopped bending his back and said nah after week I can't do nothing oh because his soul is broken fam but the problem is he never even had heart to begin with he forsook the white crow first opportunity he got bro first chance here yeah, man was dropping trial just clotting cheeks I mean I would have done the same thing I ain't like that at nah I ain't really, I ain't really giving him that I wouldn't have no. I mean, no. they said, yeah, I'm taking it, but I don't know. If no, 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 but no, bro. Here, John Snow was out there getting it in the cave. Listen, hun look, 100%. <laughs> John Snow came out here, yeah, he broke his vow and said, listen, mm -hmm. man, I could die here in the, like, with these wildlings. I'm going to get some wildling hell, and I respect him for it. But do you know what John Snow didn't do? He didn't go back and bitch and say, I broke my oath. I should go and get hanged. No. He said, listen, man, what happened beyond the war stays beyond the war. <laughs> but Cole, bitch made again, man. Man was like, oh, I broke my vows. I've got to come clean. I was like, bro, shut up. The only reason why you're breaking your vow even now is because don't forget that was after my girl rejected him. Yeah. He wasn't he wasn't even saying, Oh, he broke his vows, he felt guilty, he's going to go confess. No, he was cool to keep clotting, bro. Calm. The moment it ended, then said, I'm not gonna go so freaking oranges. This man broken. Oh, I gotta confess to the king. I got what? No, shut up. Hold it, hold it in, innit? Keep that guilt to yourself. Take it out on the battlefield. <laughs> but nah, because he bitched me. Don't know. He ain't got no heart in him. He ain't got no heart, no loyalty. And the worst part is here, yeah, again. He failed to do his duty and protect the crown prince, and because of that, he got another man murdered for it. Bitch, man. Well, the deadest plan. Yeah, walk in there. Be your twin brother. That was, that was really bad. All right. Well, <laughs> well, 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 we'll see. Let's see who's at number five on the list. Like, I mean, uh, I'm thinking Fifteen Go or Baylor. I would probably choose Baylor. Yeah, you're right. Yeah. But this Grand Master, if he's anywhere in the list, then Chris Nichols coming in. If he's anywhere near it, Chris Nichols coming in at number five. Tell you, yeah. <laughs> okay. 
because Christian Cole first and eliminate wow take him out of here and then we have <laughs> your guy so we'll let you somehow somehow defend this man okay. Eamon listen Eamon's there Eamon's about listen your dragon isn't there but it's, it's, it's Eamon or Grandmeister you're gonna tell me the Grandmeister should be there instead of Eamon all day all day all day all, all day oh, you see that now you got to in this all day you're letting your hate for this man no, no bro we kicked out what, bro, we kicked out Dali? Eamon we, exactly, we kicked out Damon fam and we were Damon fans team Damon to the death row like, okay, Damon okay. to us was the black yeah. and we and we said nah just based of character alone is Damon we can't, even, have can't a give bad season 1 Damon season 1 yeah his end was strong in season 1 because okay. again he's the man that started the whole thing I didn't like the fact there yeah, that you know it wasn't a case of where he owned it <laughs> I was like fair enough in it Vega is the one that did the thing it wasn't really you you told Vega to back off but Vega said nah listen in these streets they will never put dirt on my name bro and he didn't so, do it with no chest either like he's he, going to you the see? brothel crying about it like, yeah, you if, see, it was, if he stood in it and was that, like yeah that was the problem for me that's the problem for me fair enough, fair enough in it they got did the thing in it but the deed is done now bro the, the war started done. okay so wait hold on is no action better than regretting an act well he's done both he's had no action and written wait um, no, I just, in this in this in, in that scenario in, in, no no in this scenario of we're picking the best characters blah, 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 is no action to you guys better than no action because right. I, even having action and then regretting it is better than not doing nothing at all wait okay. it depends you got well, Fine action though Exactly Because so in action, that very Action thing, is making Okay When people wake up in the morning Are they going to talk about What you just did Absolutely In in, in the sense of So I'm going to say For season one there In my eyes I had lost his eye Yeah mm-hmm. Everyone was taking a piss out of him I claimed the bait Claimed the biggest dragon That there was Yeah yep. He'd done it in your house <laughs> It was your bum thing And he took it in your house Yeah I flew off Didn't say nothing Yeah You took my eye I have all these people That beat me up One of you's gone Yeah I regret it But you're still gone Yeah Now my brother's in power So I'm the prince Stole your phone, but fuck up, yeah. Obviously, something about it. Then tried to do something about it. I met one of your lieutenants, yeah. This is either way, how it's done, gone. Then I saw the power center, he's standing in the way, too. Brother's gone, yeah. Queen Allison was big, big balls in season one. Who locked her down? That was me. I shut this bitch down. She's now she's ready to run off and go in the, with the, the little girl and just eat nothing. Do you know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. Now, the people of the place I'm running don't like me. And like I said, stop hating from outside of the club. You can't even get in the red keep. Shut fuck up. Do what I see. You understand? Now, I'm not saying he's doing but I'm saying he's made his moves, so he's, he's doing stuff. Like, if a yeah. if eye patch went in there, we wouldn't even be talking about that. It was just bare to- All right. So this okay. I like no, 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 Baylor. No. I like Baylor, right? But she hasn't done anything other than that. Beta for me and if I put in in Jace, if Jace was in there, I'd be like, oh, oh, no. exactly. So it's like, if you're talking down the guy who you're saying, oh, hell no, I don't get this. Like, I'm saying there's potential with Beta. Yeah, I am. I ain't seen her do now. All right, let me be, if I'm being objective, you raise some very good points. You do. As much as I dislike this guy, if we are looking at it in terms of have, have the things that you have done was not on effect to the bigger story and the bigger plan. Yes. Therefore, I can give heart away of what you're saying because you're not yeah. wrong. You're not wrong. But I just can't. <laughs> <laughs> oh, <laughs> I just can't. But you're not wrong. Like you raise good points because no, essentially, like a bit, you know, this is what I'm saying. Yeah, yeah. and, oh, and you know, like a bit, it comes into it. Then I yeah. understand what you're saying. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Listen, half of the people on my list, I don't like. But I'm saying their impact. Right. If I'm talking about impact, right. talk about impact you're, you're 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 not you're not 100 percent wrong. I think there are things that Eamon has done though that are very sly and are not are not from him. In it, it's just it's just as a as a, as a cause and effect of what something around him has done, or you know, Vega kills that he didn't want him killed that. He goes, they all get the dragons, he rides off, does nothing, leaves them wine. So, yes, you're not wrong. <laughs> yeah, I want to tack on to what El said. Yes, if we're talking about impact, it's undeniable because the quote unquote choices that Eamon has made has directly affected the story. But when it comes to the manner in which they were done, that's where for me, Eamon falls off. It was very hard because they didn't give us a lot to work, especially when it came to the main character. The main characters yeah. weren't doing enough for me. Like I said before in like the early reviews, I like Eamon in the beginning of season 2 I like his subject objective some of the moves he was making in the beginning I was like oh he looking dangerous but by the time the season ended his standing it fell off it, 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 it hasn't it, fallen off lower it, than it, the so if we've got the, who doesn't we've got Clubwood mm-hmm. definite right yep. we've got Rainbow. we've got Uh-Oh definite we ain't even spoken about him I mean but you're the author of our list also like, not mine he's not on yours oh okay fair enough then you know Clubwood okay. wasn't on your list no no, 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 no Clubwood no, 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 oh, oh, oh wasn't on her list oh we haven't discussed Uh-Oh so Uh-Oh was on 
mine. I, I know mine. But the reason, like, it was close. That's why I put him in number five. The first season, uh oh, build the game, right? Doing what you mean. Second season, uh oh, where we don't. Yeah. I'm basing it off, and then we saw at the end that one end clip that I'm assuming he's been kidnapped. That's what I'm assuming. Yeah. Yeah, I don't have to him. Him. Which is why he has done enough. And yeah. that's why I said, okay, I'll give it to him. Because if, if, you, if, you, if you've if you been in one season and done your thing, otherwise he would have been as low as Damon. Because first season, Damon, okay, I see why you'd put him in this. No problem. No, but, but, but no, no, but, no, but, no, but, no, no, but, here, no, but here's the thing, though. The reason why the small time that Otto had in season two in it, Otto remained, he was, making, yeah. he, made, he, he was making moves. Even how he took the death of the Charles, they looked paraded for the bit of city, turned the city against Venero. You know what I'm saying? Listen, because this man stayed calculated. He yeah, stayed calculated. The first half, yeah. yeah. Yeah, exactly. But then again, man left when he saw that even all the hard work that he had put in, his dickhead grandson decided to kill all the rat catchers. Yeah. And parade like, the He underestimated how stupid they were. Exactly. He thought everyone was like, on at least some level of intelligence. I didn't realise they're all dumb. Yeah, I think, I mean, to be fair, he wasn't on my list, but I am happy for him to go on there only because once he left, all the impact him in there. Yeah. And I, yeah, I exactly. forgot how, how much he paid. And then even there were parts of these where I was like, nah, the blacks were yeah. what I needed. <laughs> so <laughs> I'm happy for him to go, even though he wasn't on my list. Okay. Uh, so, yeah. so, that, so that was quick. So, so we got three definitives then. So we've okay. got Rainies, we've got Oto, and then we've got Clubfoot. Yeah. yeah. I also had Young Rainera now. <sighs> It's difficult because that was season one, Rainier, and exactly. even, not even the whole list. Do you know mm-hmm. I mean? I think yeah. she's been absolute dog shit. Dog shit. So dog shit. I don't even know anymore about her. I'm sorry. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. That's 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 the thing in it. Like if if we were just pulling from one like from one season, I would have put young Rhaenyra in there. I would have put Damien in there. I yeah. definitely would have. I think when yeah. she was young, she was making. She was fine. Exactly. Oh, yeah. She was, oh, that, I can't even say she was making that moves, but she you could see that. Oh yeah, this girl's gonna be queen. Yeah, like, yeah said ambition, man. Oh, yeah, she's official she was making decisions she was like yeah, even she picked the girl, girl. and that's the thing I did, it did come across to put my, her on there but I was like it wasn't enough yeah, it was, yeah, yeah, exactly. yeah. So it's like well, that's why I didn't even know there's nowhere near my list because she just doesn't make any decisions she just None. wants yeah. to stay on drag and, and do you not see it like, so lazy so it's like at this point even if she dies tomorrow I'm like yeah I'll give someone an opportunity to right? <laughs> it's not I mean I always hope she does die and then everyone else on that side can battle for who come next and Jay saying about it even, yeah so. the- that would be great. That's what I'm saying. Like, that's how sad it is here when we don't even care that the main characters die. That just yeah. is so yeah. telling yeah. of but how we're like, uh, oh, you imagine it. Let's be, yeah. let's, let's be real though. Like, just 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 by way of the writing of Ethan, there is no one we would care if that they die. Absolutely yeah. no one. Not one person. Even as much as I love Baylor, I really wouldn't even care that much. I think I'd get over it. It would me. hurt. Yeah. <laughs> you just, you know okay, I, mean? okay. <laughs> I really would. Like, it would hurt if Baylor died. I wouldn't want to see it like before because I feel like she never got a chance to. Yeah. I think that like, for her I think for her to make an impact they'll have to you know, uh, you know like how in nursing when they jump like 20 years or however long Yeah, that yeah. is what she's yeah. going to have to do like she's going to have to turn into like a big woman now and she's just running off like her grand and her mum but like her as she's she now you see but not, the truth of the matter is yeah if we got over Rainey's dying which was sad but we got over it bro everybody else can die man because even <laughs> Baylor like I, I'll, I'll be like oh damn man like like she had some potential but after I'll be like oh man on to the next like there's, there's the no thing. death that would hold me where you see like right now I'm still mad that old Bron's gone oh, I'm still vexed listen that's not that's <laughs> no, not I mean, break my heart I'm, like I'm still vexed old Bron's gone I'm still I'm vexed that like, Gogo go is gone uh, um, you know what I mean in it come on and he died in season one yeah, as though... I'm like damn I'm like damn like nah damn. bring him back man get the dragon ball back. we need like Bruce we need like red wedding and death like we oh, like, we're not but having it but that like, if, if we really think if we're a red wedding level death yeah that would have to be in that like, one side all complete my doubt. Something has to happen. Yeah, like that. Like all they need to man. develop the character a level where care enough. Yeah. Like, that's another thing. Like we mentioned earlier, we just don't know enough about these. And that's the thing. It's, it's funny saying that after we've had like a season like Mad where they've had the opportunity to just yep. like because now like really and truly like if if they had done what we think they had done, this top five list would be easy because we'd be like, oh, I want to see her win. I want to hear you. I want to hear this. Oh, this person. This person. This is why I was so hard in the first place. Yeah. Like, yeah. Mm. I mean, top five is like yeah, I like what they're doing there, but I want to say top. Five. Uh, mm, you like, you know, Robert or something. Yeah, no, I agree. And it's like, even if we're doing it, like, I know we always always suck back to Game of Thrones, but even I know it's and I know it was longer and all these things. But even with just like season one and two of Game of Thrones, we could have done like top five villains. Yeah. Top, have this top five that. Yeah, we can't do yeah, that with exactly, yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah. Could you, yeah. you really get the feeling that no one like that? Yeah, they're a villain. Are they a villain? No, no, it's I, it, I'm just keep on reminding myself is that they stole this from, but they shouldn't be on it. Yeah, and no one from that side should be on it. Right, that's why I'm saying. Yeah. 
um, with, with the green, yeah. The only person I really dislike is Agatha. I just want her to I can't die. stand her. Yeah, I, yeah. Oh, I can't stand her. Yeah, it... and, and the thing is, she's not even a real villain. It's like, some of these villains are not villaining. Do you know what I mean? Yeah, yeah they're, they're just not really. Exactly. <laughs> it's like, yeah. you do things and then you cry about it or do things but it's kind of underhand but it's like, you know, you're halfway, you're there, you're not really like, we need someone that's just even out and out. Yeah, we are. We are. We're, 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 we're way off right now. It's, it's, still... it's because House of Dragon got nothing for us. That's right. <laughs> they <laughs> got nothing for us. Nothing. Yeah, we are. Um, uh, yeah. Okay. All right. All right. All right. We'll, we'll cycle back. We'll yeah. let, let's, let's, yeah, yeah. let's go back to what we're doing. No, yeah. Yeah, no but, we were just talking about young Renee. Yeah, that's what we picked it off, Eddie. Right. Yeah. Yeah, but it, yeah, no, but it tied to rock, like the, um, do that thing with, do with, um, Renee and what we're talking about. The problem is, yeah, again, it's because they haven't written characters well. Yeah, they have. Because Game of Thrones, they do seasons and we understood people's journey in two seasons or for what they gave us, right? Yeah. We, did, we didn't know where they were going to go, but for what they gave us, we like we could clearly see, okay, they're heading in a particular direction. Some of them swiveled, some of them went left all, but you understood the characters. Whereas in this show, we've had two seasons and the main characters that we have, realistic, is really four. Renéa, Alison, Damon, iPad. Those are like the real... Right. That's your main character, you know? I'd just say... No. Maybe about... Like, like, if you're going to put posters, you're going to put Renéa, Alison, and Damon, aren't they? they? I would put the two for the black and the two for the greens because realistically, like, they're the only ones here who are really doing something. So I would say in terms of main character, those four for me, even in me saying that, I don't care and I don't know these characters. They give you like little moments of, oh, it's too much of, you see like where somebody has to explain it. Yeah. Like they have like they have yeah. to tell you for you to be like, oh, okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. And you're like, oh, no. Yeah, it's That's true. I like you with it, Nana, earlier. Um, like they had so much time. There was so much talking. Yeah. There was so much unnecessary things. Like you could have done so much with this. Even if it wasn't as much action, we could be like, you know what? When as much action, but oh my god, like this whole world has been opened up and you know all of these things. Like yeah. nothing, non star again. Like, non star, yeah, um, yeah. yeah, where we're at, really. And we still even decided. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, we ain't even got into honorable mention no, either. We, so we've got three, haven't we? Yeah, we yeah, got, yeah. Uh, we, we've got three, and the rest and the rest are all just um, question marks. So we've got Club Four, we've got um, Rainy, we have Otto. So those, so those three we've decided. The rest we were mentioning and two more spots. Baylor's edging in her question mark, like, he might make the list, yeah. I, can, I mean, I, can we, we could even just say the top three, you know? You know what, yeah? Yeah. I think for the sake of argument, let's just, yeah, let's just do top three and then the rest can just be honourable mention. Okay. Yeah. I mean, unless 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 you have a strong object to anybody else who isn't, Eamon. <laughs> That's the only person you care about. <laughs> Nah, I can because I think most of us. Yeah, I think we did. They're the same. I think we agree on those three. That there's like for these two seasons anyway, because this list completely change at the end of season three, right? I had mm-hmm. yeah. That should change in a few episodes, to be honest. Exactly, mm-hmm. it could be changed after the first. Yeah, <laughs> like, yeah. You know, but these top three out there, yeah, the, these are the best characters. And the, cra- <sighs> the yeah. crazy part is, we have three characters that's got like the least amount of scene time as well. That's yeah. Not them I even mean. Yeah. You know what? Yeah. It's those are the ones with the most depth, though. If you really think about it. Yeah. When yeah. you think about it, because it's like okay, look. I said about Otto that like, yes we don't know huge amounts about him but at least he got a, a snapshot into his mind right then we've got Rainey's like she's been holding it down since season one and then we see a little bit of her love life we see a little bit of her family life we also see her being a rider and since and it's also the fact that you, you, she's the queen that never was so there's that, that, yeah. that whole you know element yeah. of it as well where you're like oh okay like, she should have been but literally what they're doing to Renee they did to her so she lived that story before yeah yeah. and that's why she even back there in it I said you know what yeah I wasn't able to accompany I'll be damned if I see it happen again. You you have a real chance to become the first queen of the Seven Kingdoms. Yeah, she's gonna riot. She's lost her kids, her grandkids are about. She's active in them. No, you know what? Yeah, Renee, anyway. yeah, man, she's she's something. And then we've got Club it, who again, no one saw it coming really, but <laughs> he's on our list of number three. Mm, you know, listen, I won't even lie to you. Like, yeah, the the last the last two episodes is what really saved Club. Yeah, the so Club Foot was I, missing. Yeah. He was mm-hmm. missing for this whole season. Then the last two, he came. Because he came in there and just blew past to the front, man. Yeah, he like, yeah. All right. It, it showed me because I know he's the master of whispers, but it's like when he had that exchange with the other guy on the roof, mm. sort of like, well, see, you can do yeah. that if you want, but that's all. Like, like, I grade my, I grade my rumors. This wouldn't even have made it to, <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> to my desk. Told, this, is a, this is a throwaway one. Didn't do that if you want. <laughs> even though it turned out that he was right, but yeah, no, uh, there's a process for club. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, 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 I don't no. wish that we hadn't been his one of I really do. And I know you. 
you guys yeah. were saying that you think that it was like I think it's all a lie. It's a lie, man. I don't. It's a lie, and I do wish they just left it out. I don't. Yeah, I, I, because I, because I put like I said before, you know how they say in it, like to make a lie more believable, mixing some truth in it, and that's what he did. He wove that narrative. He saw he was broken. Okay, I'm gonna connect it to him on an emotional level because he's broken right now. If I come like with this whole statistics, da da da, he ain't gonna cook it. Like he's not gonna resonate. I'd be like from one crippled man to another. They say the end. He played into his ego. He said, "Don't worry about it. Like, you're so destined to become king." And they underestimated your entire life. But like, this time, they're gonna use it to your advantage. I was like, "I get it." You know, even what you mentioned about the whispers thing on the rooftop. The funny thing is, do you know that I looked at that whole situation? I read that. I read that scene a bit differently, you know, because I because I read it like where he manipulated that man into not. Yeah, there was that's, elements of that. That's but do you think that's, that's oh, so how he I did it on purpose that he? Yeah, so he knew. Yeah, yeah, like, he yeah, like, yeah, yeah, like, yeah, yeah, like he, like he knew, like he knew, and you're like, nah, you know what? Yeah, because again, Comfort is giving me the energy in it. Like he's been in the background, yeah, just collecting information, and now he's trying to formulate the, the best possible outcome for himself yeah, and the best. Yeah, and the best yeah. outcome is for is for Eamon to, to be, that, yeah, yeah, like to be a disadvantage because he needs this man out. The picture that I, you know, and even how he said it, like you can do it if you want to. But I don't know, innit, man? It sounded kind of shaky. They even come from the main source. It was a guy that knew a guy that knew a guy's cousin. I looks kind of shaky to me. Like I was like, ah, oh, yeah, 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 you know, you're right, you're right. But you know, if you feel like doing it, go ahead, do it. And he was just yeah. like, nah, that sounds stupid when you say it out loud. That like, yeah, 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 I won't do. I'm just like, yep. <laughs> but this whole time, and that man, the, the little kids came and told him, you know, they're taking busters out the. Out the town. He's like, what? Ah, uh, stay not. I'm staying not. It's true, low key. You know what? That, that even gives him the level. If if he did like that, he's even higher now. So well, actually, I put number one. So that's fine. I would say, okay. So I'd say we have them three. I would say let the people the last. Mm, that's, that's a good one. Yeah. Let, yeah. Because we're gonna we're gonna give it to you guys. I who should be the last. Um, should it be Daylor? Should it be iPad? Or yeah. should it be Grand Mason? Like, uh, yeah. The, uh, I think that's an argument. I have the argument. Grand Mason yeah. or or Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I and, always, and guys, <laughs> for the comment, for the comments. Just just, just comment which one should be. Don't say that of those. Just tell us which out of the three. Give your know. reasoning. Don't listen to me. Give your reasoning. Oh, show yeah, your yeah, yeah, out. yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> show your workings out. Tell us why you're picked it. But Baylor, Grand Mesa, I've had. Yeah, I yeah. won't even lie to you, you know. If you bring somebody that we didn't even say. Hold on. Can I give an honourable mention to Friar Tuckley? <laughs> Come on. <laughs> no, you know what? You, you know, know, you know what? No because if mention. you say he's good during these, man, I'm not getting it. That is, I, no. I still don't believe that. He is. He is. I don't care. No one's going to tell me no different. I'm, no. I, I would lie on this all my no, nah, I can't even. I can't even lie. I can't even lie. I agree with Els because when you start to look at look back at his interact, whether whether or not yeah, he's directly doing the dude. He's definitely aware that it happened. Of course, I mean, anyone kept on met but like Ali knows it's happening because they the wit that they call him grandma. Yeah. All I'm saying is that yeah, this man do but his statement that Ali I'm right. Yeah, if but that judge, I do not know what. It is. Actually, actually no, I can't lie. That, that's a very weird response, Danny. You can't lie. That's a weird response to have. If somebody's gripping you up, are you just gonna like blow? So you know what I mean? Me. Like like. <laughs> What, like, 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 what would make you think yeah, the blow is going to stop him? <laughs> that means you tapped into something in it, man. The, oh, well. the wind whispering. I told him the same way he said traitor. It said I'm, blow. I'm, 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 I'm telling you, if he turned out to have powers, I, I will literally be shocked. My mouth will be open. It, it, no, it's only because I'm like, you know, so far I've gone off his one. This is not the one. <laughs> it's them. He's got them. He's season three. I'm going to remind you of this. Yeah, 100. <laughs> uh, uh, 100. If there's a scene here yeah, where Black Allison is walking to the way he would be, he comes out of the Tron and then Brian Tuck comes and says, Are the pieces in place? And she says, Yes, bro. That's a confirmation thing. Yeah, that, that, uh, yeah, that would be. Huh? But then, yeah, no, that would be, yeah. Uh, if uh, if uh, she come out from a tron from talking that way, would and then he says, So, what's the next step? Anything along those lines, are like, mm, or no, you even come to be different because you let's say, let's say I knew had powers, I don't have powers myself, but I'm just waiting for you to get your dream vision, whatever. I don't look that on, but I still don't have powers myself. Listen, when he just blows on a few more people, we'll have our combination in it. That's exactly. it. <laughs> well, yeah, well, yeah, no, nah, it was good again because L's good, L's good with the full and he got blow on somebody. I'm because I'm because I'm saying, yeah, that he's that again, he definitely don't have the same powers in it like not even in the same league but he's touched enough here the way he understands what's happening and he knows his role like we said you don't blow on a man's face that is that is a, that's a weird reaction to have <laughs> there's no way yeah, you would think and again Damon's unhinged at this point my man is literally having conversation he's blacking out mid convo and he can't even remember what's being said and now he's like oh you're all trying to kill me and he puts a knife to your neck and you just say you blow nah bro 
Again, that's because that wayward tree here told him, blow now. It said, blow now. And he blew. And man just calmed down. He's like, all right, wait. <laughs> There's also that weird black goat that kept on turning up weird all over his castle whenever Damon was roaming around. Black what? There was a black goat. If you go back and watch the season. Right. Yeah, there's, 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 this, there's this random black goat here that always turns up like when Damon was either doing something like construction work. It's just there, random. Oh, really? Okay. In the black sheep of the family. Uh, yeah, it was maybe. Uh, maybe, yeah. Maybe. Symbolism. Or, it was all that was fire tuck. <laughs> Fire. Oh, I've got that excellent. Love it. So he love can it. change into Adam. Yeah, man was shape shifting, fam. He's a shape shifting goat. I love oh, it. Wow. <laughs> oh, wow. Man was, was, was shape shifting, bro. Like, because he was there keeping our Damon. Because and the crazy part is, yeah, even how even how man was able to hear the conversation so clearly when that man was whis was whispering to Damon about betraying Renero. <laughs> bro, his his ears were too sharp, and that raven flew too quick. <laughs> that thing, that thing, damn, they teleported into Renero's lap. Damn, for car <laughs> traders, <laughs> Aaron Hall. Fly back now. This role, for some reason, was finally sent now. Because, again, I get that Damon wasn't sending a crow back. But this entire time here, yeah, Damon has made it very clear that he's building an army for himself. Why did he send a crow during that entire time when he knew that Damon was building an army for himself? Yeah, Why did that, he... was, yeah that, that was about hours. And now they couldn't tell the Renero. Yeah, 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 I'm trying to say, innit? Yeah. Because he knew he knew for a minute that Renero was in danger in terms of Damon had already gone off the reservation. My man was proclaiming himself king. He knew all this stuff, but no raven went to it. But the moment, the, like, the, the way Woodry said, Oh, that's when man said, ah, okay, time now. No, 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 no. Bomb out. Let's go. He can hear the he can hear the way Woodry talking, bro. He heard it. And he said, nah, wrap it up, man. Bro, fly. <laughs> so, so he so fly tuck gets honorable mention. Yeah. And I've, and he tapped he tapped into the source. He's not he's he's not as deep in it. We don't know that yet. Well, that's true. I'm saying it's not as deep in it. Els is saying that like he's, he's fully in fully in <laughs> with the judge. Yeah, man. I'm not saying fully in. Both saying he's halfway in. I'm saying he's old, not even. <laughs> it's it's just in the wall, you next time, it? <laughs> we will see. <laughs> so again, also in the comments, half of you tell us. If fire tucks in all the way, or if he's halfway in, <laughs> or if he's not at all, let those comments consist of who should be the, the final two. And is fire tuck is he in the club with the Jones or not? Another honorable mention for me, it has to be the whore from I don't know from Bravos. Helen. Okay. No, 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 no. Bravos is uh, what's it called again? Because Veneer's new sighting. Oh, I forgot all about her. Yeah, I forgot yeah. all about her. Honorable mention. The funny yeah. thing is, she was a side character, but majority of the black news was based off her. Yeah, I. Do you know what? I feel like I was a little pointed because I should make a bigger impact. Yeah. I mean... Wait, who are we talking about? You know, um, Rhaenyra's girlfriend. Oh, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. 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 yeah, like, that's all of She's very forgettable, but yeah. what she did pushed the narrative. Yeah. So, so that's why I think... Yeah, yeah. yeah that's why I yeah, think... Yeah, yeah. To get to this honourable mention. Oh, yeah. Who? Yeah. Yeah. She was in two. She was Damon fighting. Yeah. Damon yeah. Trick. Yeah. 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 I think they missed a yeah. trick with her because even though she did four things, they could have filmed her in a way that made it look bigger than it was. And yeah. we would have been a bit more like, ooh, but they just made her stand there all the time. You know what? we got to set the pace. And little red riding hood as well. It does yeah. 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 She might even have to make it. Even when you think about it, right? Because one, she sent little red riding hood to again to spread all these all these false rumors about the green. Yep. Then she was the one who even convinced Renera to send the food. Yeah. Yeah, I mean in it. Like uh, uh, and, and yeah. then she was the one who helped the thing about the Targaryen bastard. Yeah. So when you really deep it, because she, she did, did the most strategy, Yeah, she yeah. did the most, but she, she had and, the and, you know, she had to come up story as well that's a tip yeah 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 so actually you know what yeah she might have to she might even be bumped up from honorable men to potential yeah, yeah. potential okay. potential because if we talk about impact yeah majority of yeah. the stuff that was happening is because of her, because of her. and we even got a little backstory as well. yeah. true true you know her mom just slit her throat yeah that, crazy. Uh, that, that well. the belly. yeah do you know what i'm not like <laughs> <that. laughs> <laughs> <laughs> Oh god, yeah. Um, yeah, she's up. Okay. So we've added another one to the potential to come up to take the top five. So as it stands now, the four question marks we have is Taylor, Eamon, Grand Mesa. We don't even know her name, but <laughs> like a whisper woman. Yep, whispers, whiskers, whispers. Let me even quickly Google her name if I can find it. Oh, Miss Sonia. Okay. Is that her name? Like, if, yeah. If that to me, I wouldn't know you. Uh, yeah. Oh, then. We would we would not have got that. Ain't another one called that got a similar name to that, the red one in friend. Was that Miss Sandra? Oh Lady Miss Sandra. Yeah. Miss Sandra, yeah. yeah. Oh, they could be Related, yeah, oh, they give that same vibe, her and her could be related somehow. Misara is her name, so those are the four, you know. If we're even really being honest here, yeah, she can take Grand Mesa's place. If I'm being, <laughs> if I'm being real, if I'm being real, yeah, yeah, so, yeah we can we can pick out Grand Mesa and Misara can take Grand Mesa's place. They both begin with M anyway, so easy trade. So the three is going to be Baylor, Misaria, Amen, guys. Yeah, so you know, I, I can't even lie to you, you know what, yeah. 
Yeah. I can't I can't even lie, you know. If if we're being real, if we're being real, Amy Misario, those would be the five. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> like, this is after, yeah, like after after this conversation and just talking about people that were actually doing things, good or bad, in it, like they made moves happen and they pushed the story forward. It has to be those five as the five. Stop grinning, Nana. I'm not grinning. <laughs> Yeah, I'm listening. Okay, <laughs> I know with it, boy. I just like you can put it out to the people. We can still give yeah. it out to the people. Then, man. Listen. Yeah, no, nah, you know what? People them still go off in the comments and and say who you want to, um in the five. I'm saying off this conversation and just looking at it objectively. For me, the five it would have to be Eamon, Desario, Club Four, Oh Oh, Rainy. Those would be my five. I can't give you the order. Yeah, but the five characters for me off this bus, that's mine. It's crazy how we almost forgot that woman. Yeah, I'm telling you, literally, it was only once El said honorable mention, and I was like, oh. Ooh, you know what yeah which side character would I give honourable mention to I just, I just started re- listening off in my head and I was like oh wait a minute that woman was actually yeah. out there with the female nah. music I thought the song was like a black like cupboard though because like, no one yeah mm-hmm. but like if all hell breaks loose the black go I feel like she would survive yeah yep. she would she definitely would she definitely would the only the only thing which I can see happening did you know like where they captured her like how they captured Miss Sunday yeah and then they, they kill her to make an example that kind of thing but even then though she's been captured before she's that was mm. true, true, but at them times there, no one really knew her value in it. Like they, yeah. kept, like they, like they kept underestimating it. Damon just saw her as a as a concubine who could get little little information. Oh, oh, saw her value, but the only bad thing is, oh, oh, wasn't a man that um honored his word in it. Yeah. Yeah. Was like, Guys, um, that was our thoughts and our opinion. I know that we went all over the place. We definitely went on a massive tangent just to try and break a top five. We got there in the end, but we went through hills and valleys. So with that being said, we're gonna bring this episode. So to a close, like we mentioned before, please sound off in the comments. Let us know who is your top five and who would you hit and why. Like always, please like, comment, subscribe, and we will see you at the next masquerade. Bye. 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 Bitch made Davis. <laughs> <laughs>